Yes. Uh, today I'm driving. I just turned off the music because I don't want to get any strikes, man. So I got. But today I'm driving. Uh, I'm driving today. If you know, we're in Sweden. They have a big uh, food company. Uh, we big shop chain of shops called Ika. So I'm driving for them at the moment, and they're the biggest. So you know, they 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 sell a lot of food, and you can see I'm I'm driving a really long truck. You know, it's like. It's 25 meter, man. It's really, it's, it's not easy to drive, but it's it's it's, it's, it's fun though. So um, yeah, because you you know normally I uh, I drive the um, the tank truck, the tankers, and deliver diesel and petrol and ethanol to the to the um, petrol stations. But um, you know I just work there extra. I'm, I'm extra. Um, I just work extra for the tanking company and here I'm working extra so you know I get to uh, vary you know if like uh, right now there's no one there's no um, they have no need at the moment to drive tanker truck because for the company I work you know the, all, all the drivers are you know there's no one sick or anything like that so uh, I mean um, I do have a sh- I do have a like a shift there, you know. Like I got six or was it seven days, six or seven days this month in in October, delivering diesel and petrol. Six or seven days out out of what is it in October? It's thirty days there. Yeah? So I'm just uh, covering, you know, I'm just covering up the rest of the days driving food at the moment. So it's quite good. So it's, it's really enjoying. So. Um, but this this type of work, they can't get enough driver. I mean, they would love they would love it if I would drive seven twenty four seven. You know, they would really love it, even though it's illegal. But that's how much they need people to deliver food here in Sweden, man. Because there's not enough. They need a, they need drivers. So uh, you know, but I mean, uh, I mean, it, it can be stressing at times delivering food. To the, to the supermarkets this is why I, you know I just kind of I don't really you know I mean uh, I'm, I, I don't mind doing some extra shifts delivering food but I don't want to you know before I used to when I started to drive trucks I used to drive like food five days a week and I'm telling you it was tough it was really tough um and I just, you know, I was getting headaches every day and nosebleeds, and then I just decided, I decided for myself that I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do this type of job every every day or even five days a week because it's it's just it's it's just too stressful. It's too much stress, and then you know you have to, you get the power the pallets, you know, you have to deal with the pallets and you have to deal with a lot of things here. So um, for me, it's two days a week is okay. Two or three days a week, it's, it's 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 okay. So now I'm at the. This is the big warehouse, Ika, Ika warehouse. So I'm just gonna leave all the empty pallets which I collected from the supermarkets. So it's it's, it's really big here. Um, yeah, but I see it's a quite big, tr- quite a big truck. I'm driving quite long. I like uh, you know for me the longer the better. <laughs> the longer the better. Or the longer the ease, it's the easy, the easier to drive. Uh, these are the normal Europe trailers, you know, where they have 18 meters. Uh, let me see. Anyway, um, I'm just gonna drive, get in here. Wait, I'm just gonna. Wait. One second, I'm just gonna check in here to be able to get in. Take off my belt. Let's take off my belt.
because um, I'm kind of new here. Um, I don't know if you're checking. I don't. I don't even know how to. You know, because you have to press a certain kind of code to get in here. So uh, I'm just going to try and. Uh, I think somebody's going to ask because I think I pressed the wrong code. But I mean, I mean, to get in here is like getting into Fort it, Fort Knox, man. Really, you know. But you can understand. There's a lot of food here, man. A lot. And a lot of trucks going in and out all day so I'm just waiting for them to uh, to uh, answer this com telephone and then I'm gonna show you I'm gonna show you how to re how I reverse how I can back into this port it's, it's I mean because I've been driving these long trucks for a long time so it, you know it's, it's it's quite easy but if you're not used to driving these you know imagine if you have like a normal car and then you, you know you rent a trailer you know those kind of open trailer or whatever but instead of you know or say, say imagine you have a normal car and you have a ca you have two caravans behind that car two caravans connected that's what it's like to reverse one of these trucks it's, it's really weird it's really it's really it's, it's really weird you you have to you know if you have a normal car you have two caravans you have to concentrate on the caravan in the middle to if you're going to reverse you have to concentrate on the caravan in the middle so that the caravan be behind that caravan you know you you can steer it you have, or you, in other words you can you have to use the caravan in the middle to steer Oh, to steer the caravan. Okay, I got. A, oh, weird. Yeah, you have to use the caravan in the middle to steer the caravan behind. Anyway, they just let me in. There's something, something really weird here. I've got to go in, in and out again. Because my shift is finished, I could only do a half, half a shift. They wanted me to work the whole day, but I can't do it. I just can't. You know, because. Um, I couldn't even, uh, to tell you the truth, I couldn't even work this morning. I started, what time did I start? I started at 5.15 today. And, you know, they really begged me yesterday, please, you know, if you can't do the whole shift, just do half the shift. You'd help help us quite a lot. So, um, you know, I just said, okay, let me let me help them out. So when I, when I pressed the... the um, when they let me in here, let me know, just let me know. I just saw that they gave me a ticket for the other half of the shift. <laughs> uh, but uh, little do they know, I'm just going to unload the empty pallets and all that, and then I'm going to go and leave the truck back at the at my workplace, so the next driver can come back here. I hope they, I, I hope he'll, he'll be able to get in here. So uh, these are the empty. I don't know if you can see these the empty trolleys and then uh, the, the empty pallets. This is where I have to leave them all. I don't even know if I'm allowed to film in here, but you know, we'll see. These are those of the empty pallets, so I have to. Uh, I don't have much. I don't, uh, you know, I don't have much uh, to unload here, so it's it's okay. See, it's quite a lot. It's really a lot. It's a lot of um, a, lot, a lot of trolleys here. So this is where I have to reverse, I have to reverse the trailer in here, um, from 1 to 10, it's easier for me to take number, I'll take number 5, take C5, I'm going to take C5 here, so this is how you do it, <laughs> it's kind of complicated, I wish, if I had someone outside, I'd, I'd let them film me, but um, let me see, let me see, C5, I've got to try and concentrate on doing, this thing is like, look at the trailer, man. It's, it's, Jesus. it's like really bendy. Okay, let me try to see if I can get C5. Yeah. So right now, if you can see my back wheel, my back wheel, I have to line it up with the line. And that's how you do it. And that, it was perfect. Let me just take down my punk now. So I can see C5 in the window. I can see C5. And all I have to do is just, when I reverse, just line up my back wheel, my back wheels with the white line. So that's how you do it. 
and that's that's like you have a normal car with two caravans behind. So it's kind of like wait, it's it's, it's it's not easy, man. Yeah? Nah, it's, it's, I'm just joking. It's it's, quite, it's, it's it's not difficult for me. Okay. It's quite easy driving this truck there. These big trucks they're automatic. You know, and it's, it's really easy to drive. And then I'm concentrating now on the middle, the wheel in the middle to try and get everything lined up with the white line. You see, I don't know if you can see it properly. I'm just, that's how you do it. You firstly concentrate on the back wheel and then concentrate on the middle wheel. Now push it forward a bit just to get everything straight. And then back it up. Straight. Get it nice and straight. Yeah. I've just got um Wait, let me get it straight first and then I have to go out and Yeah. Look at that. That's perfect, man. Okay. Man. Can never be that is perfect. Perfect reversing. Now I have to go out and actually open open up the the back. So you can come with me. Yeah? I just get just for you to get an idea how long this truck is. It's really long. Just back it out. It's really really long. Uh, I don't even know how many wheels. <laughs> how many wheeler it is but it's quite long so I'm just gonna uh, open up the uh, the door at the back actually I, uh, I you know I do I reverse this is one of the best reverse I've ever done backing up normally it takes me well it doesn't take it take a little bit longer to line it all up but um, it's quite it's, it's good so now I have to Turn this thing on here. That's just to get the to get the uh, lift down. It's all automatic. And then uh, press here one two just to get a green light. Uh, it's really hard to get. And let me press two again. Oh yeah, now the green light is on. And then I press this one here. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. So. This is all new, the new, I prefer the older system uh, where you just press it, but you know, you use those buttons, it's, it's easier, but you know, I mean, all this new stuff, man, I'm not used to it. A right, little bit more, come on. See what I mean? I just, it's just, it's, I have to try and uh, get a bit more, tilt it a bit more. Uh -huh, one, two, one, two. Oh, yeah, yeah, tilt it like that, and then. Down. It's got to go underneath there, so it's going going down, but not to hit the ground. So I think, yeah, this should be enough. Yeah, and I don't really have to open the door because uh, you know the, the that is you know the hit the the bridge is down. So the only thing I have to do is just reverse it in and go in and open the door from the inside, from inside the warehouse. Back it up to the, and it's quite quite good. These trucks, you know, it's got beds inside. You know. Some some of them have two, but this one has just one single bed. Okay, oh, the engine turns itself off. Okay, 
Oh, that's good. Just to say fuel, you turn off, turn this off. So I'm just gonna just to see like that. That's the handbrake. <laughs> this is. E e I'm telling you, to drive one of these trucks, you can ask. You know, truck drivers. I know what I'm talking about. It's it's, it's like it's probably more. More harder to drive a car. <laughs> it's so easy. Everything's. No, it's just. Okay, let me back it up. On the... Okay, I think I'm against the. Yeah. Just chop. The thing is, when you reverse up to the uh, to the port, it's good to go and check just to make sure that that the you know the bridge is gonna be able to go up and it's not gonna hit the door or anything like that because then I have to come back out and reverse you know do everything let me see just see how it looks here behind here yeah it's all good yeah looks good okay there's a lot of big trucks in here man so sorry yeah so I'll be finishing in about half an hour and then I'm just going to go home. So it's, 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 it's all good. I think this guy wants to get here. I could actually film this dude. Because he's driving the same, same big truck as mine I'm doing. Well. Okay, let me get in there and do my thing. This guy's driving a nice big truck. So uh, I'm just gonna go in and do my thing. <sighs> so um, yeah, I'm just gonna see this guy. I'm just gonna turn the camera on. Uh, yeah, he's gonna <laughs> see what he's doing here. Ah, there's a door, yeah. Yeah, it's all good. Anyway, um, thanks for watching. I'll uh, get back to you later on in another film. Bye.